Hey Libra, welcome to Good Witch Intuitive Tarot. This is going to be your reading, weekly reading for anyone who's guided. This reading is for anyone with Libra placements or anyone else who's guided to see this reading here on YouTube. This reading could resonate now or later on down the line. You have no idea what's coming to you, Libra, but it's going to be good. Wow, how nice. So, behind the mask. Ha! milestone and happy success big big situation happening here it's a graduation it really does it's look at your high state of consciousness see at the top it's a consciousness card happy success an event is some kind of milestone happening in your life and intentions behind the mask i feel like you don't know this is coming this sometimes when this comes out as a first card it says to me you have no idea this is coming it's beautiful it's almost like a beautiful graduation of uh, i don't know what it is it's beautiful but let's get into it spirit and angels anyone for the highest good for libra anyone with libra placements or anyone else who's guided that was the quantum oracle this is the crystal vision i'm so sorry quantum oracle crystal vision and the wheel of the year all right let's keep going spirit and angels anyone for the highest good what do we need to know libra reading for anyone with libra placements or anyone else who's guided to see this libra reading for whatever reason they've been guided here what do we need to know what are the messages libra reading one more shuffle libra reading what are the messages libra reading i feel one more shuffle libra reading all right let's do it all right, behind the mask, milestone and happy success. Excellent. Too many. Can we just do one or two at a time? Libra reading one or two at a time. Okay, wow, I bent that one. Four of Wands, beautiful. What else? Libra reading for anyone who's guided whenever they're guided this could, could resonate now or later behind the mask milestone and happy success okay excellent all right so well there's something been going on you've been stuck in some i'm going to put this one back up here i feel like they need to stay together because they show what kind of energy you've been stuck in i'm going to leave them up there together and i'll pull three more okay give me a couple more here please world reverse yeah so absolutely so you've been stuck in some kind of weird energy here libra i don't know if it's uh why i don't know if it, it's like a disappointing kind of energy where you felt really down about something i feel like this is about to change six of swords yes yeah, stuck up in your head unable to move forward so was this physical or was this emotional give me another card please tower is gonna hit boom and guess what there you are libra queen of swords okay so you have no idea what's coming there's something coming your way wow really okay so here, something comes in for you the page of pentacles and it takes you immediately out of the stress that you've been in it's some kind of truth or clarity that comes in so there's something coming in and i see that again here with your card of the, the uh, queen of swords who's libra for me all right we have the emperor we have the high priestess reversed and we have the moon so this is information you didn't know coming out has to do with the emperor or you could be the emperor if you're masculine uh this is going to bring you in some kind of truth and clarity in something i feel like whatever the thing is that the truth and clarity comes in about has to do with um something that you've been very disappointed about ten of cups reversed and five of pentacles and death reversed unable this is like a death and rebirth card see how it's the death and the rebirth and look at all the butterflies this is something we would want to see in the upright because keeping it in reverse keeps you in the five of pentacles this is i can't get out of the five of pentacles i'm sad i'm lost i'm lonely i've been left out in the cold something disappointing happened and this is all you being stuck in it okay that's why i wanted to make sure they all stayed together all right again the world reverse says you've been unable to move into a beautiful new cycle but guess what you don't know it but it's coming it's coming 
Um, it's going to come with this tower. So don't fear the tower. The tower feels to me like something that's finally going to go boop and bring you in your new opportunities and your new beginnings that have been stuck coming in with some kind of milestone event and you are going to be very happy about it all right whatever this is six of swords has been completely stuck you know six of swords is usually we get in the boat and we move forward mm -mm. just like the world reversed just like the death reversed you have been grounded and i don't mean in a good way i mean like you can't move. I don't mean grounded as in you're grounded. It's in you, you know, you're feeling really grounded and, and stable. It's not like that. This is more like you can't budge. Um, but something's about to change all that. And I don't know what it is, but we're going to find out. Wheel of the year for clarity here. What is happening here? spirit and angels anyone for the highest good libra reading for anyone with libra placements or anyone else who's guided to see the libra reading what is happening here for anyone who is guided to see this reading what are the messages you could be a libra uh scorpio cusper too because there's a lot of scorpio coming out in your reading which sometimes makes me feel like we have a libra scorpio cusper in the house or several of them actually or you could be dealing with the Scorpio. Again, when I call out the reading, uh, the signs, please don't feel like you have to make them fit, okay? They're just for the people that are good at astrology and knows what know what's going on. I had a lot of cancer come out um, this past week, and it all had to do with the big cancer moon that we just had. So it didn't have anything to do with anyone's astrology. Well, not everyone's astrology. It had more to do with ast astrological events. So remember, sometimes these... Um, energies that come out have to do with uh, astrological events so don't try to force it if you don't know okay all right i give them out as a courtesy to those people that do know how to use them all right spirit and angels anyone for the highest good one more sh no i'm going to do two more shuffles i think two more one more now one more shuffle libra reading all right let's do it all right so first thing we want to look at is i want to look at the ten of cups in reverse with the death card in reverse and the five of pentacles the three that i was reading together up there all right we have queen of wands reversed and we have the um temperance in the upright this is sagittarius energy so uh, you could be dealing with a scorpio or a sagittarius and they would come out in the same energy they could be a scorpio sagittarius um cusper or have a lot of their sister signs right any of this could be your own energy but i feel as though you're dealing with a person this queen of wands reversed and i feel like this person has i feel like this person's a sagittarius or has sagittarius strongly in their chart whether you know it or not you might know them as a scorpio like i said okay Sorry about that, guys. I hope the noise wasn't bothersome to you. All right. So um, <clears throat> I feel as though there's something about a disappointment that you've been stuck in. It has to do with this person, whoever they are, right? Let's get some kind of information on the four of wands. Why is the four of wands here? What do we need to know about that? Okay. We have the wow all right well we have the knight of pentacles reversed and we have the star so is this something that uh has another card of not budging not budging right so i feel as though have you been uh, i almost feel like you've been unable to budge in something because of something that happened between you and this person you were unable like this is i can't move like four of wands you know it's about the four of wands could be you know moving to your new home it could be um being involved in a relationship it could be anything right but with this knight of pentacles here it's reversed so whatever you wanted that has to do with the four of wands peace in your home happiness joy in your relationship or to move i feel like you could have been wanting to move because your moving cards are in reverse i feel like you've been unable to do it this could be something could be changing here for you libra where you 
were unable to move for some reason you were stuck in something you were unable to I don't know why you were stuck now um, let me get another look well let's keep going on the world reversed and the six of swords reversed. this world reverse could be that moment of that milestone that's coming in let's look at that first tell me about the world reversed what it why is it here like this what do we need to know world reversed Libra reading why is world reversed what do we need to know Wow okay we've got the knight of cups here now the knight of cups is in the upright now showing me a sense of forward movement where there was a block and we can't move before let's look at this give me another one on the world reverse what else do we need to know the world in the reverse what else do we need to know we've got a challenge of the two of swords reversed as a challenge all right so this could be um is it a decision that was keeping you blocked because this is a libra card the two of swords for me i feel like were you undecided on whether you should move or where you could go why though why were you yeah look at this i want you to see the bottom of the deck four of cups and libra the justice card disappointment about something or the inability to move forward about something i feel like you were unable you couldn't decide or you you could weren't able to maybe the decision wasn't yours tell me about the six of swords reversed what do we need to know six of swords in the reverse this uh, so many libra cards coming out you get nine of cups this is wish fulfillment some kind of clarity truth and forward movement keeps coming out all the knights are now in the upright okay i feel as though you're now forward movement there's something something happening here there could actually be information coming forward that helps you um tell me or just clarity of some kind coming in tell me about the tower what is this tower what is it sometimes tower is good real good sometimes ace of pentacles reversed i want to get a peek at the tower one more time tower what is it we ten of cups i really feel as though you are going to get this ace of pentacles you know when you see my readings all my readings i feel as though an ace in reverse just says we got to figure out how to get it in the upright like it's a new beginning trying to come in you're going to have this new beginning and you're not going to be stressed anymore either nine of swords is reversed at the bottom of the deck there's a healing coming in for you you're not going to be in the five of cups anymore everything that was daunting or scary or upsetting out the door and it has something to do with this new beginning that's coming in for you um i don't know exactly what it is but it's ten of cups it's happiness it's happy success that's happy and this is happy right this has something to do with a new beginning coming in nine of cups wish fulfillment something about you being up in your head and stressed or in a, uh, unable to make a decision or move forward but this new beginning is tr trying to bust its way through um oh, let me see what the decision is here why two of swords as a challenge here with the world reversed why is the two of swords a challenge in reverse at, with the world it's like you're not sure where in the world you want to move to if that's what it's about a move oh wow oh my goodness okay well look at that <laughs> the two of cups ace of cups this is a new beginning and it is a choice that you'll make and look the knight of cups came in with it is this going to is somebody going to come in and make you an offer and you're going to have to decide whether or not you want to progress this forward whatever it is like you don't know this is coming so this night kind of just shows up and kind of blows your mind and is like hey do you want to be a family because i'm going to offer you stability i'm going to offer you love i'm going to offer you everything you could ever imagine wish fulfillment sorry it took me so long i don't know what this is libra honest to god i have no idea i'm going to pull a couple after tarot on it real quick because i think we have a couple minutes we could spare 
Can I get a couple after tarot for Libra on what's... I mean, this is really a big deal. It's four of wands. It's star. It's two of cups. It's ace of cups. It's ace of pentacles. It's being divinely guided in. And whatever it is, it comes on the heels of something that either didn't work out or something that just was stuck. So in other words, when I look at this, this could be between you and let's say um, a Scorpio or a Sagittarius, doesn't matter to me what gender they are, but I feel as though this is something where something happened between you and a Sagittarius or Scorpio, or they don't have to be those signs, but that's the signs they're coming through in that um, left you feeling out in the cold, left you feeling sad and lost and lonely and was completely like nothing budged. And now all of a sudden out of, no, out of somewhere, <laughs> someone walks into your life and blows your mind, whether I, I'm going to say whether it's the, no, okay. At the bottom of the deck, you do have the five of cups reversed coming out of a time of feeling like there was no hope. See how she's looking at all the five cups. So, you know, I just wanted to see what was at the bottom here. So, I mean, honestly, behind that, you do have the lovers and the king of cups reversed. So, you know, this could be you coming out of something with someone, or it could be a new opportunity coming in after a time in your life when you felt like everything was stuck, nothing was moving forward. You might have gone through like a breakup in the past. This all feels past, right? Uh, you could have dealt with something to do with uh, this. Now, you, this emperor might be coming out with these secrets around them because you don't know they're coming. Remember, behind the mask, you have no idea that this person's coming in towards you. This is another thing. This might be someone you know, but you don't know how they felt about you. They've been behind the mask. A lot of times that behind the mask card means I haven't told somebody how I feel about them. Okay, let's ask a couple of tarot, uh, after tarot. Could I? <laughs> really? The two of cups flew right out of the deck. Can I get one or two more cards here for Libra? Anything at all that would help us understand where this person comes from or what this is about? I mean, it's clear to see that this is somebody cut divine timing that someone would speak a truth to you. So it's time. It's the wheel of fortune. So somebody's going to speak a truth to you and come bring this together. You don't, I don't know if you know this is coming. It's high priestess. It's, it's a secret. They're going to expose how they feel about you or how they're going to expose the truth that's been hidden quietly. They've been very quiet about this it's been a secret i don't know if it's a secret how they feel about you i that's what it looks like to me and this is not the first time this has come up this week we had something like this i swear in the weekly readings last week there were two signs that had similar messages to this and then this week during the daily readings i swear i think this came out again something like this because it's been like a thing this week to talk about secret feelings someone coming forward please let me know libra i'm going to be like i'm not going to be able to sleep tonight i need to know who this is for <laughs> is this your reading I mean, you don't even know maybe oh my god anyway let me know if you do know okay um let me know if you feel something like this coming on as the high priestess you might already be getting um been feeling this coming on for a while um good luck with it libra um did we pull you the little cards no we didn't okay we're gonna pull you angel cards before we leave if you guys would please do comment and like the video it helps the channel grow and i always love reading your comments but uh liking the video helps the channel grow a lot and i appreciate it, it tells youtube to uh actually um, show my videos which helps the channel grow and I appreciate it um, other than that please do watch your other readings your dailies your weekend financial readings should be out by now actually it already has been out um, by the time you see this also your monthly um, January readings I think I'm gonna put them up in the left hand corner they might be up like right now or they will be any second Okay, what else do we need to know? Libra reading from the bottom, please. We're going to pull from the bottom, Libra, and see what just comes out. Joy came out. I see that one. Boy, that's a lot of cards. I'm going to put all the face down ones back. Joy and truth came out, but I do want one more. So I'm going to just mix them. I just can't take like seven cards. That's way too many. Just one more. 
risk. Wow, someone's going to come in. I'm telling you. And that's what it is. One of the daily readings says they're going to come in hot. You're not going to see them coming and they're going to come in and profess their love to you. I saw it. It's a daily reading. That's the one I was thinking of that could be for you guys. Somebody's going to tell you the truth about how they feel about you. I'm telling you. And look how they're facing each other and how they're just coming together. I'm telling you. I don't know what this is, Libra. Joy and risk. All right. So keep this in mind. If this comes at you, instead of freaking out, which you might do because this is going to come so out of the blue, think about possibly letting taking a risk. Think about it. Because Spirit says on this one, it's going to bring joy. Taking this risk will bring joy because someone is going to tell you the truth about how they feel. I don't know what this is for everybody, but wow, it's kind of mind blowing. Please do let me know, Libra, if you feel like this could be coming in for you or is this going to blow your mind completely if it does. And Spirit again says, this might blow your mind, but it's going to bring you joy. They say it again, over and over again, actually. Wish fulfillment coming in. Um, a true commitment coming in. Uh, brand new um, coming together here with you and your person. Both all in the upright. All these cards of joy and happiness coming out in the upright. This is your person um, that's going to come in and speak this truth to you or admit something to you. And, you know, if you're a masculine, same thing. It could be a feminine coming in to reveal their feelings to you. Or if you're same sex or non-binary it doesn't matter okay it really doesn't matter this is for all people who will watch the libra reading and resonate with it i do wish i knew more about this but i feel like this actually turns out to be an inaction this queen of wands reverse like an inaction or it ends up being someone from the past uh doesn't mean they're the same person coming back in but it comes on the heels of something that happened to you that was very disappointing in the past and you're going to be reluctant to take this risk because you don't want to get hurt again or you don't you know doesn't mean I don't feel like it's the same person. If it is the same person, I'd be surprised. Or I, you know, it's probably only a few of you. Okay. I feel like this is someone you have no ideas coming. And that's why it's going to be like, boom, out of nowhere. What? It's big. It's big. Like, that's why it comes out as a milestone event in your life. Because it's something you're always going to remember. Because it's the thing bringing joy and happiness into your life. I don't know exactly what it is. Good luck with it, Libra. Thank you so much for joining and for commenting. And especially for hitting that like. I appreciate you guys. Your monthly reading should be up in the uh, upper left corner. Unless I decided to put something else there. Okay. Talk to you guys soon. Thanks so much. Bye.